Hi everyone, so welcome back to my channel. My name is Aymuda if you're new. Thank you for tuning into another video. If you're an old subscriber, thank you guys for returning and watching another video. We are on 200 plus subscribers and I'm really, really grateful for you guys. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video and also check out my Instagram so you can actually keep up to date with me, whether it's my business, my fashion, my luxury or my lifestyle. But thank you guys for tuning into another video. So I put a poll on my Instagram and I put two video polls one for a spring lick book and the second one for luxury bags under a thousand pounds and a luxury bag under a thousand pounds what so in today's video I'm going to be showing you 10 bags under a thousand pounds that you can actually purchase for yourself especially if you're actually introducing yourself into the luxury market as well these are actually just going to be proper handbags i didn't include any pouches so these are strictly bags that i think might be beneficial for you guys as well so i'm going to be sharing new bags from different designers and i'll try and put pictures in the video as well so you can see and links but i thought this video might be helpful especially if you're actually starting off into the luxury space and you don't want to be spending that much money and something that you can actually save on as well so there'll be 10 bags from 10 different brands i think i maybe i've got two brands from the same place but just so i can give you some variety within the brands so i'm going to be showing you the first bag as well so i'm going to be telling you about the first bag there is so if you bear with me i finally got my new phone i'm finally on an iphone 12 pro max and i really really love it i was on iphone 7 before but as soon as i actually downloaded it and started working with it i'm so so used to it now so i absolutely love it so i'm gonna be reading from my phone so the first luxury bag under actually i've got the bag i'm gonna go show you okay so the first bag that i want to show you guys is actually from gucci and it's a bag that i already have and it is the gg marmont bag now i got this bag in a black and it's got the gold hardware so it's got the gg and also the gold chain as well inside the bag also has business cards from myself and also this keychain holder as well because you can actually um, attach the bag and make it into a short holder I've seen people wear it around their waist this is like one of the best bags I've ever got one because of how small it is it doesn't fit a lot of things but do you know what's crazy it actually fits my new phone I was worried actually by upgrading but it wouldn't fit but it perfectly fits inside here so if you carry the big phone it literally fits inside it and it's perfect so I thought I don't have to hold my phone anymore because that was one thing that was stopping me from getting my new phone just being it too big but it fits in my smallest bag now this bag actually retails for just 750 and I think this is a good um, price for Gucci especially because it is a black bag it can go with anything and you'll find that you can actually style it and wear it with anything so this is the first bag I love the leather I love the fact that it has the heart design at the back as well I love the um, diamante I love the diamond stitching on the bag as well i just think as a good basic bag to have if you're going out you don't need that much just have like your card holder your phone keys and basically like a lip gloss and then you're done really so i think this is perfect for a good size especially if you don't want to carry such a big bag around and you can wear it during the day and you can also use it as an evening bag as well by actually shortening the strap i just really really love it i think it's so so nice i always pick it up it's a bag that i always gravitate towards especially because of the size and because of the color as well so the gg marmont bag is only 750. the second bag that i want to show you under a thousand pound is the ysl envelope chain bag and i'm sure you guys have seen it It has the gold hardware of the ysl on the front of the bag it's got the chevron and diamond and um, stitching on the bag and it's in leather and you can get it in multiple different colors i love the black but since i've really got a black bag i think another color will be useful as well i will try and show you but i think what might be easier is putting a picture on the side as well i love the gold hardware anything gold even though i do wear sometimes but silver um jewelry but i really do love gold hardware as bag as well and um, it retails for 850 pounds and i think this is like a nice evening bag something that you can actually take out for dinner somewhere something that you can actually take to the club and um, since we're allowed out now finally well not finally it'll be june 21st in london but i think it's like a nice classic bag to have nothing too big as well most of the bags that i'm actually recommending are quite small bags something that you can actually take around with you but i really do love the color they do have a variety of different colors on the ys 
sell website they have like some nude colors i have a white a black and like a nice red deep red perfect for autumn time as well but i really do like this bag it is very very flat what i've seen in store as well but i think it's nice and compact and something that you can actually just put away i'm not sure if it can actually fit your big phone so it's something that I'd recommend actually trying but if you're actually used to just carrying your phone in your hand then I suggest just carrying your phone in your hand like normal but at least the GG Marmot bag allows you to hold your phone as well so that is the second bag that is under a thousand pounds. Now dare I say it this bag that I'm also going to recommend is just slightly over a thousand pounds but I had to include it in this video because it's such a nice brand to have especially if it's your first designer bag and it is the Louis Vuitton Alma BB. Now this is a bag that I've always wanted. I've seen it around. I think I really like the bigger version as well. I think it's such a nice staple bag. I love the fact that it has the double zips as well because I think it's perfect in actually doing up the bag and there's multiple colorways. You can get it in the Demi Air Brem print, the usual original LV print. You can also get the colored leather versions as well. There's blue, there's black, there's red, there's all sorts of colorways as well. But the BB is just small enough for you to carry and I think it's a nice brand since it is Louis Vuitton as well and this bag retails for 1,190 so just 190 pounds over but I think it's a nice bag to actually have and include in this haul as well I think when I first when I've seen the bag already I really really love the um the black version like the just black leather version it's got like some lines across the bag that really looks like really good and like sturdy leather I think this is a perfect bag for you to actually just start off your actual Louis Vuitton journey because I know everyone gets the speedy bag because I was I got the speedy bag first when I started in my luxury journey as a gift when I was older but I think as a nice introduction into Louis Vuitton I sort of get in the Neverpool bag that everyone has the Alma BB is a perfect bag it's compact and it also is amazing quality since it is Louis Vuitton as well so I'm going to be putting pictures so you guys can see the different colors that are available because I think they're so nice and I think maybe it should actually be something new that I should add to my wish list normally when I actually already have a bag from a particular brand I try and branch out into another brand and instead of buying something from the same brand <laughs> but I think Alma BB is a really nice staple bag to have especially if you get it in a nice simple colour but if you're bold you can always get it in the other colourways that are available as well. So however if you don't want the standard colour whether it's black, nudie, pink or even like red you can get the original print for 1030 so I think that's an amazing saving so the Alma BB in the Demi Ben with the gold hardware and the brown straps you can actually get that for 1030 I have to double check the price yeah and I think it is so so nice I love Louis Vuitton I love the red inside the bag I think whenever I look for Louis Vuitton bags some people like the pink and um, I really really go for like the red interior of the bag and I think the quality of Louis Vuitton bags are really really amazing as well so the Alma BB in the Demi Aben canvas is only 1030 so I've given you two choices here really so you can actually choose from Okay, so now we are on to Balenciaga. Now, everyone's buying this particular bag, and I know you guys have probably seen it, and it's probably more of like a trendier piece that's out, that's been out since last year, and it is the Hourglass bag. Now, I know the original big Hourglass hourglass bag is around like 1400 pounds but you can actually get the hourglass bag in the wallet and chain version and that retails for just 750 again it's similar to the gg moment bag it has the gold hardware as, as their um chain and um, it looks sleek especially if you find that you're not really into the um the trendier pieces i always think getting a small version of a trendier bag is a lot better because it's suitable for any occasion if I see like a trend piece and I really do love it, I try not to go for the big version because I think, am I really going to want such a staple piece in the next year or two? But if it's a small version bag, it's something that you can actually kind of get away with and actually wear it like for decades because it's so small it's petite and it actually suits with any outfit as well the color that i always see is the black version but i'm sure they actually have multiple um colorways as well it's got the bb logo in the front of the bag and also the chain i believe is adjustable so you can actually wear it depending on your height as well there's some days i like to wear my bags get a crossover but sometimes depending on the outfit i like to wear it over my shoulder so it gives like a new type of look as well 
of course you can do that with the Balenciaga Hourglass wallet bag as well so this is like something that is really staple I'm giving a lot of wallet bags but I think you guys really want nice going out pieces as well especially if it's spending something on designer it's something nice to put with an outfit just to elevate it and you didn't have to spend that much money so that only retails for just $7.50 okay so now we're into Prada I am just really really loving Prada and it's so crazy that I don't have anything from Prada and there's stuff on my wish list that I really do want from there so I'm actually looking at myself like why haven't I invested I know everyone's got the different type of bucket hats and the small um nylon bags but I think this is a bag that isn't too trendy as well I know the nylon bags are back it's something that's come from like the 90s and everyone's got them in different colorways but I really wanted to give you a bag that isn't as trendy something that you can actually wear with any occasion as well and it is called the Prada Duet Travel Bag now this is actually like a mini bucket bag if you will when I first saw this bag I fell in love and I'm actually going to tell you the price because it is under a thousand pounds and it is gorgeous and I have multiple different colours as well so the green one that I've seen because I'm obsessed with green right now I'm not sure what it is but like a nice deep emerald green it actually retails for just $9.50 it is in the nylon material it has the gold hardware it has the short handle so you can actually carry it in your hand as well it comes with like a nice drawstring like a nice bucket bag and I feel like it gives casual without actually looking really really casual as well so you can actually pair it with a nice outfit if you want to have like a nice casual bag with it of course as well especially because everyone's got the classic nylon bag you want to be different you want to stand out and have something different from a lot of the people that are actually buying the nylon bag at the moment but this bag I'm looking at it right now like it is sensational and of course you can actually wear it crossbody as well because it comes with another strap I just think this is such a good investment especially with how small and petite it is the inside of the bag looks insane like guys i think you should really check it out i wonder what other colors i know they definitely have it in a black oh so many colors they've got burgundy navy fuchsia they've got fuchsia cocoa brown cocoa brown um garnet the green is called oleander green now if that's not given emerald I don't, I've never heard the word oleander before but the green of this bag is so so stunning and I've got it in a nice pink and you know colour is in this season especially this summer so I would definitely get this in a nice colour as well and also it has a zipper pocket in the front of the bag now this just screams I'm try. I'm like I'm putting a nice outfit together I don't want to look too done up but I want to look like I've tried I love those effortless looks and I feel like that bag can really actually take your outfit to the next level so this bag is gorgeous now the next bag I'm going to talk about is another bag from Saint Laurent YSL and it is the Lou camera bag now I think a lot of you guys have probably seen this bag already but when I actually kind of look at the bag it's actually a nice bag that you can actually wear casually and also done up as well again they've got it in multiple colorways as well it's in the nice smooth leather and it's got the chevron material on the front of the bag gold hardware again it comes with a nice strap as well and it actually retails for exactly bang on a thousand pounds now what i love about ysl if they bring out any nice specific colors that year you'll find a lot of the time when it comes to christmas they do good sales so if there's any bags that you have your eye on and it's a particular color actually wait until christmas time because you can actually find a good bargain with ysl that's what actually why i like saint laurent you can always find a good sale with saint laurent compared to any other brands they do a very good sale that's how i got my nano sac de jour last year because i actually waited for the christmas sale and it also comes with a tassel which is actually removable as well so you don't have to arrive it being on there and again multiple colors from black to nude to red i think they even have like in a gray as well and it fits a lot so if i showed you the gg gg marmont bag if i showed you the balenciaga hourglass wallet bag and you find them too small i find that this bag will actually fit more than both of those bags put together as well so you have more space if, especially if you find that you carry a lot I carry a lot sometimes as well. I've got my wallet, my compact, my lipstick, my car keys, my house keys, my phone, and I'm just like, oh, okay. I guess I can't take this bag again today. So if you actually kind of like a bigger bag more than the standard what's in right now, small mini bags, I think this is the biggest bag that you'll get, especially if it's bang on a thousand. So you're actually getting what you pay for. 
Okay, so the next bag is from Fendi and I really, really do enjoy this brand. They've actually got a mini, little mini pink bucket bag. Now, I showed you the bucket bag kind of from Prada, but I wanted to give you another bucket bag option from Fendi. I think it's so cute and petite, especially if you find that you don't carry a lot. And I think these bags are perfect for holiday. One, because you don't really carry a lot when you're on holiday, but picture this you're in Santorini you're going out for dinner with the girls or with a partner and you just need like your room key you just need your phone and you just need I don't know whatever like your card just to pay in money that's a perfect bag just to take out you're not carrying too much as well and it's a great bag that you can actually take away as well you can actually take away just to normally eat with your friends but i think having bucket bags are kind of nice especially in the summertime because they can actually be styled of anything and what i like about a bucket bag it goes really nice with a casual outfit sometimes you might dress quite casually and find that i can't take like a really nice bag because i'm not really going for that look if you find that you still want to look cute but it's still done up at the same time you can always take a bucket bag and the pink one from Fendi is amazing and I think it retails for just 9.50 let me just quickly double check yeah it retails for just 9.50 the pink one I've seen the pink one and I'm not sure if they've got any other colors yes they do oh my god they've got so many nice colors for summer they've got like a nice green they've got a brown they've got like a mint color they've also got like a really really light lilac like an off-tone pink and a deep red and I feel like those bags are looks sensational the hardware is gold again i keep showing you gold hardware bags but those are just my favorite bag it is a hundred percent calf leather um so that is amazing as well it also comes with a detachable um handle as well which you can take off and it's perfect because fendi has the straps or if you have straps of your own just to actually make your bag look different you can always put that on the bag too as well but i love this bag and if you find because the strap is actually too small you can also carry your own strap and make it longer as well so you can actually wear it crossbody and i think that's such a good idea as well so it gives you bucket bag you can put things in it's got this drawstring so you can close it up as well and it's perfect for if you're just going on holiday or just quickly running errands because you can wear it across you or you can hold it in your hand okay so the last bag i actually want to talk about is for a mum like a new type mum that really wants a nice baby bag like a diaper bag as well because I know that I have different audiences whether you're actually around my age younger or you're just a new time mum and I know people actually really love the designer diaper bags and I found one and it, it's just slightly over a thousand it retails for £1,250 and it's from Prada and it's called the nylon Prada baby bag I think this is really nice and sleek it's got the little pocket in the front it's got the Prada logo on the bag and it, I saw, of course I saw it in the black which I really love as well so this is everything that comes in the Prada baby bag so it comes with the woven handles it's detachable and, adju and adjustable 100 centimeter logo print woven shoulder strap it comes with a front pocket with a zipper and a mat inside which is amazing for changing it has open side pockets and a back pocket with zipper of course it's got the metal hardware enameled metal printed logo on the front a zipper closed it has the Prada logo nylon lining with three pockets including the one big zipper a small feet on the bottom so you actually doesn't have to get too dirty as well which I love from a bag as well it contains a bottle holder with drawstring and fabric mat and a rare strap for your trolley I think that's a bargain for 1250 something that you can actually attach on your bag and it's something that you can actually look cute with like you might have your Prada bag for the day but do you know what I think for me like I know when I'm older when I have kids I really want to have like a nice baby bag especially if you find that you do like luxury handbags but you also want to be stylish too so you can actually have your nice Prada bag for your baby so you can actually put your stuff in there too as well so even if you're not carrying a bag for the day you still feel stylish because it's black as well it actually suits um, with anything that you're wearing and it can fit all your baby stuff in there I think that's a really good bargain for £1,250 so that is all the bags that I would actually recommend to you under £1,000 please do check out the description box that way you can actually see the bags I've recommended down below as well thank you guys for tuning into another video I hope you actually find this video quite helpful and useful please like this video if you want me to do luxury bags under £500 because I've actually got a list as well and I think when I do these 
these when I actually start finding new brands I might actually start recommending like baby changer bags with the brands that I find that way if you're a mum and you're looking for like a nice baby bag you can actually find one too but thank you guys for tuning into another video I hope you enjoyed it and don't forget to check out my previous videos because I'm really grateful for you guys showing me the love and support and leaving comments I love to know what kind of brands you love just so you can actually share with me too as well but don't forget to check out my Instagram and stay up to date with me and I hope you guys have an amazing rest of the week. Bye guys.